G-Rex run another one Uh, another thing I wanted to get into before I be, um, I want to switch it up a little bit because we we're supposed to talk about this R&B artist in the states. Up next six, um, A and R for the streets. Uh, they did a little. They have a podcast out now, uh, A and R for the street podcast. So big them up. They did a big interview with Jay Prince. Okay, okay, so, okay. Um, if Friday can run that. Yeah. So what do you think about the rappers out here dissing the dead and talking about it smoking and this fact? How do you feel about this culture? Because back then, hip hop was more like direct. There was no nobody was really dissing the dead like that. Like I feel like hip hop when it comes to like the street hip hop and things like that, artists tend to diss the dead a lot. Like, why do you feel like hip hop is going towards that way? And how can like the culture stop stop this whole like shift from happening? Because it's really know, toxic. You know what I mean? Yeah. No, no, I agree. You know, I, I was explaining how, you know, being a rapper now is almost like, you know, being involved with the dope game. You know what I mean? The way, you know, the, the value where lives are concerned is is like meaningless. And uh, mm -hmm. in order for that to change, you know, once again, it's going to have to change at the top. Man. It's going to have to change, you know, with, with us as parents. You know, anybody... Thanks that's a parent and that's becoming a parent, huh. you have the power to put the right ingredients in your child to be different. Huh. Don't ever yeah. think that, you know, hip hop has raised your kid. You know, I'm a, I'm a perfect yeah. example. You know what huh. I mean? Like I'm a yeah. perfect, even though. Like yeah, shout out Up Next Six. Shout out JPEG, huge friggin' interview. Um, I can't wait till that drops the full thing and I can actually take that in, but yeah. Yo, are parents feeling feeling the youth them out there? Uh, out here? I would say so in Toronto. I'm not even gonna lie. Parents are feeling the man them. And the gal them. Some of the gal them out here. I feel like it's like kids having kids. Mm. And like there's a lot of like young youths, like you know, like 16, 17 having kids, and they're having kids with the wrong person at the time because they're probably young and they're in love and they're not using protection. And you know, things just just happens, and then you know, like the media, social media, everything like fuck. But you gotta still if you if you make that responsibility of having a kid, you got you know, your life is mosh, fam. You gotta know like parenting is first. You gotta worry about that you. Yo, but sometimes it's not even her, it's like the man them, like man them, yo, man them, like, you know, man them are doing, man them are battering things, man them are doing everything, you feel me, like, for some, man them will leave their house three o'clock in the morning for some pussy, you know, so Gosh. it's like, obviously some mans will use condoms, some mans are not, and you know, just things just happen, and they just have to deal with it. But but as a parent now, as a female, then, then the female, you gotta be a parent. Like if the man is not in in the life, you know shit happens. I'm, I'm like shit happens. You know what I'm saying. But at the end of the day, you're a parent. If you're not gonna give up the kid, you gotta be a parent, fam. Like your life is that you. You gotta raise somebody. And I think a lot of like even regardless of the situation that you're in, a lot of them have failed their kid. Like right or wrong, the situation that they've gotten put themselves in to uh -huh. get the kid, I think they failed the kid. What do you think, Debs? Hundred percent. Yeah. I agree with you still. Yeah. I don't know, man. Uh, parenting, parenting, do better, man. We 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 gotta we gotta watch these young generation, this young generation, because it's sticky out here, fam. The shit that we're seeing, even the shit I'm gonna get into you too. Like, yeah, you know I'm saying you you you've done some crazy shit out there, fam. Okay, I'm a demon, like. But so <laughs> we're gonna get into that too. But so not to knock your parents. Do you think your parents failed you? Hundred percent. They weren't. But I don't even talk to them, anyways. I'm the one that cut them off. But if they tried to get back into your life, do you think you would? Nah. Nah? Nah. All right. Fuck, man. Parents, do better, B. Do better with your youth, man. You don't want you don't want these demons out here because Debbie, <laughs> Debbie might catch one of your kids, B. You don't want that. They be on six bus quick. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, R&B artist Anne-Marie arrested for shooting her brethren in the head. Did you hear about this story? Whoa. Yo, this is wild. Whoa. So... I sent I sent you the, the tune with her. She got a song with Young Blue that she came out. I think it came out like a couple of weeks ago. Yeah. 
Yo, so she sounds she sounds nice still. Got a little following. But the, the situation is sticky. So the story I'm hearing is I guess she was playing her and the, the man were playing around with the gun. Yeah. And the gun fell and bust in his head. Oh. We don't know how. That aim, the aim on that far, amazing. But the man survived too. So I guess they're waiting to, to see what the story he's going to say. And he's, if he's going to snitch on the girl and be like, yeah, the bitch tried to shoot me. But she said, uh, the cop, when the cops got there, they're saying she was hysterical. She was crying, yelling, asking if she's still alive. And that's the story she's going with. Mm-hmm. The story she's going with is it fell and whatever. A lot of people, a lot of females are riding with her right now. And I'm like, yo, that's fucked up because... Just the other week, like you guys wanted to cancel freaking no, not the other week. The other day, you guys are trying to cancel Tori. Yeah. So shouldn't it be the same thing? Shouldn't y'all, y'all chicks try to cancel females when it's the other way around? See, they have excuse all the time, so you know, right? <laughs> it's always different for females. But yeah, nah, that's messed up though. You can't, you can't like cancel Tori and then look at her and say, "Yo, I'm riding with her." Like, come on. What about the story though? You're believing that you're rocking with that story? Now I feel like it's an accident though. You know, like no I no fucking way. I don't feel like she actually like she probably did have it on her, but like I felt like she was just trying to scare like, scare the man. Like you know, like my G. <laughs> please tell me if you guys have ever ever heard a story where a gun's fall and it hit a man in the head. B. Oh, in the mm-hmm. head. Fam, that shit don't even happen in movies. But, but yo, anything's possible, you know? Like, I'm when, not going to knock it and say, yo, that never happened. Nigga, like, if, if it happens in the movies, the shit, the gun ricochets and hit, the bullet hits off something and the, and the chandelier falls on the nigga's head or something. I've never seen in my life a gun fall or, like, in the movies, a gun fall and hit a nigga in the head. Damn, nowadays, our life is like a movie. <laughs> you feel me? So you can't. Facts. You feel me? Like, Facts. everybody's watching everybody, so. Your life's like a movie, so you know, like it could have happened. I don't know, but I hear what you're saying, like you know. But I feel like it was an accident to me. That's you, my opinion. What do you think, Dubs? I feel like people are just shooting people, and that's what it's gonna say. <laughs> 2021. Time. I swear to God. It's demon time. Oh my yeah. God! See, fam, no way she nah be. See, that's what I'm saying. Friday. <laughs> you, what's your take? You, you believe that that gun fell? Um. It's hard to call it, you know what I'm saying? Because shit can happen. You know, you could drop the gun and the shit goes off. <laughs> Hold on, really quick. Sorry to cut you. I apologize because the other, just last week I said, yo, we got to stop canceling people. <laughs> so, let me hear. Cancel. <laughs> I'm not but, ready. Um, Here's the thing. We'll find out because there's ways of the, um, the ballistic specialist mm. being able to find out where the trajectory of the gun came from or where the bullet came uh. from and whether all this is really true. So when they figure all that shit out, if she's arrested, then she was capping. All right. Another question I got for you guys. I guess not kind of because, well, I guess you're a demon, so you're going to do it anyways. <laughs> a shorty shoots you, fam, and you survive. <laughs> shoots you in your head and you survive. Uh-huh. What's your next play? <laughs> like, you yeah. go for revenge on the bitch or she's, she's canceled first of all well obviously and second of all you don't want to have nothing to do with that girl you're not trying to get revenge she just tried to kill you my nigga you're not trying to get revenge you're yeah. not trying to death father L- listen i don't i don't encourage man on women violence i'm just saying though the bitch shot me listen. i'm just saying i have no comment on that one so. <laughs> <laughs> don't cancel me i'm just being yeah, real no comment fam we have to no i have to pay for us to get in a boxing fight or something there's no way you're shooting me you're getting off like that b that's wild bro you're getting revenge though i'm calling 20 man's deep straight up jeez yeah i'm calling short 20 i'm calling debbie <laughs> i'm calling debbie <laughs> hopefully me and debbie are still cool and yeah debbie gang, debbie gang will deal with them <laughs> <Sure>. um <laughs> Little baby was in the news. He got himself. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Before you move on with that story, right. you're talking to somebody who's been stabbed by by an ex before. <laughs> <laughs> so what have you? It's documented. It's not new shit. So, hmm? not trying to get you in trouble, but I like, fucked what? her again after that. Oh my fucking <laughs> god, this nigga is toxic as fuck. Like we, like she apologized. Obviously, was the was the pussy better after? 
Like, was she more no, willing to give you some of the same, the same, the same it shit? Same. It was the same. And we broke up again, obviously, after that, because I'm not with her now. Yeah. But nigga, it, she had an explanation. I was cheating on her. You know what I mean? When she came in and she f- discovered the evidence of the cheating, I already told the story before. She spazzed and woke me up to me getting stabbed. Yo, now that I think about it, that's crazy because I fucked the girl that stabbed me after. One of my shorties and my girlfriend, she did. But it's stabbing. So if you got a headshot and you lived and she's like, I'm sorry, I did it by mistake. You might fucking smash her again. Stop oh, lying. see, yeah, see. Yeah, yeah, he's right. He has a point. He there. has a good point there. Because she could call and say, yo, listen, I'll, babes, I, I'll give you like. You know, like, threesome. Um, yeah, I'll give you. No, not even threesome. Come on. <laughs> no, you got to also understand, like, on, prior right. to the headshot, you seen what happened. You were there and you lived. It's not like you got headshot and you died and nobody knows. And she said, oh, it was a mistake. And when you come back to life or whatever, you're going to be like, yo, I do remember right before you fucking dropped the thing. And oh, and then, then I went, everything went black. Right. Oh, but if you were the guy and you seen the girl drop the gun uh-huh. and then everything went black and then you come out of your fucking coma and you're like, yeah, she did fucking drop it by mistake. What if he did say that? Okay. Yeah. If like if it was <laughs> I don't think ac- he's gonna sniff. if it was an accident for real, then he's gonna go back because if she's she might blow up after this. Everybody knows her now. Mm. You know what I mean? Now like that happened. That was probably mm. like the so called sacrifice. And but you know so that happened, and now her name is everybody's talking about it. We're talking about it now. That too. I don't know if, if they were dealing because they said they were friends. I don't know if they're actually together or anything like that. So I don't know that part if they're together or they're just bridges. But too like. I don't think he's going to snitch, though. Regardless of what, I don't think he's going to come out there and say, yeah, she shot me. Yeah, but he might accept her apology. That, too. I, I still think the bitch shot her. Shot him. <laughs> and I still think that you females should chill on that whole, oh, yeah, yeah, she's cool, or she didn't do it. No, 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 no. The same energy that y'all had for niggas, we need to have for uh, for men. Or for the same energy you have for women, or for men, you need to have for women. Sorry. Shout out to Yeah, shout out to <laughs> Uh Rap capsule coming out just now. 